All right, so this is gonna be a tutorial on how to make a USB handbrake for the PC. Uh, this is a handbrake I had before. The USB port snapped off of the Arduino. I just didn't think it was a very good option. So this is a Thrustmaster uh, USB joystick. Pretty cheap, I think it's like 20, 30 bucks or something. It worked great for me last time. So this is the exact one I used to have back in the day. So yeah, we're gonna just take the handle off, limit the movement so it only goes up and down, put a hand grip on it, you're good to go. So let's do this. All right, so once you get those four screws out, is just cut these off. I'm gonna trim down these plastic tabs on there so we can fit a grip over that. So I just happen to have a bandsaw here. So I'm gonna see if I can get footage of me cutting my finger off. All right, now I'm taking it over to the anti-tinder. I got some Gorilla Tape. I wrapped it once around there. And then I got some half inch PVC pipe. It's painted black. I'm gonna slide this over. The only reason I put the tape on was because it was a little bit loose and I don't feel like getting another PVC pipe from the store. So now I'm gonna go ahead and drill through here. All right, so now there's probably nine or so screws in the bottom that we're gonna go ahead and take out. So yeah, make sure you dump these all over the ground where you can't find them. So now that the screws are out, I'm just gonna go ahead and pop that off carefully. All right, so as you can see, you've got the front and back movement, and then you've got side to side movement. And in the back, you can see there's a hole right there. So what I'm gonna do is drill through that and put a screw in there, and it should limit this from being able to go um, side to side like that, and only should be able to do that. Find a screw. Cool. Now you've only got the front to back movement, which is exactly what you'd want. All right, so what I ended up doing was put putting a rubber band around this just to make it a little bit tighter. I'm sure you could go to the store and find a spring that would work a little bit better, but for me, I think that's gonna work just fine. All right, so I'm on my set of settings. Gonna click handbrake. This is my sim. I've got a Lexus seat out of my car. I've got a quick release hub so I can use the wheel out of my car. And then we've got the new handbrake here. I'm gonna give that a pull. You can see I've mounted it right in front of the shifter. Seems like a pretty good spot for it. So it looks like um, it's halfway through the range. So we're gonna go ahead and slide that to 50. And we are good to go.